right, um, Fambulen, welcome to another edition of the Then and Now program. Me where they talk to Ona today, the 5th of May, 2020, today's a Sunday, and the time on my side is just five minutes past eight. I'm in name Prince Emil Cromer. Cromer, spelled K-R-O-M-A. Um, today, we get a very, very special program as usual, and we get very, very special guest on a very, very important um, topic. So I want to say thank you for those of whom are waiting on tune in. Just a quick hello to Brother Daniel, Dama Watson, uh, Kobe Cabo, um, Guy Rai Ben um, Aladi, Yusuf, and uh, Sister Janet, just a few people that I see. And uh, they ask, say, do you allow me to share this um, video so that everybody will be a part and parcel of this national discourse? It's absolutely necessary. And we get two fantastic guests in the person of no need much of an introduction, but as a matter of, um, of um, programming, as a matter of um, um, righteousness, obligation, we say we want to welcome Mr. Kutubu Mohammed Koroma to the platform. Mr. Mohammed Kutubu Koroma is equally um, a very, very outspoken um, social media person. And also on the panel here today, we get another critical mind in person of Mr. Mohammed Supermed Kamara, who is also in the broadcasting business. So gentlemen, let me welcome Una to the Then and Now program. And um, I wish Una very well as we host this interview or this talk show this evening, this afternoon, this morning. Yes, thank you very much, Brother Prince Emil Kuma. Okay, that was a sound check. Thank you very much, Mr. Mohamed Kutubu Koroma. I guess you did get me loud and clear, sir. Thank you for an invitation. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay. So, ladies and gentlemen, here is the point. And um, it's really not new. It's been ongoing and it's captivated the minds and the entire nation has been hooked up to, to it. It's um, been dubbed in some quarters as the trial of the decade, because not very long ago in our lifetime, all of us with Sidonia, we also see another trial of this kind in which there were many points of views, many notions, many opinions, and et cetera, et cetera. But today we are still here and luckily we've witnessed another. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not even trying to pretend for, I'm not even trying to pretend for convince you now about the point of view via using rhetoric on the questions they want to go and post to the guests. As a social broadcaster, I know a great deal about rhetoric. I can assure you of this. Like my friend Donald Trump could say, this is very serious. I can assure you of this. So I can assure you now of this. I understand rhetoric when I see them. So I have no intention for use them for convince Una with the watch for, you know, yeah, try for convince Una on the basis of rhetoric on this very, very serious matter. Now, he make on this basis, I call two eminent person them for can help so we will carry this talk go forward. But just for create or talk about a background perspective, a context, if you like, it's not very long ago. This is almost like three months ago. Um, retired Major Alfred Paolo Conte, a former defense minister under the erstwhile um, government of um, the All People's Congress, and also a minister for security in the country, which is um, um, the interior, he got involved in something which came to captivate the minds of the people, the minds of the Justice Department, where probably is upturning what we normally know in the past. I said probably. And this is not part of the argument today. So the retired Major Alfred Paolo Conte in Liberty was seized sometime in July, I believe, um, not in July, rather, back in May. The president um, invited him as a person we get understanding. This we all know, no need for go deep into that because we may expect some catastrophe in form of a pandi uh, pandemic upon we country. So it's like since you understand this thing, you've been there before, you already get a set up, 
we can just activate them and go straight into the business so that we people them we can protect them. Me and one person we um, commit the, the, the calling of the president, which shows cross bipartisanship. When it comes to nation building, yes, all man can get inside, but there are times when we close ranks. So on that basis, the president in his infinite wisdom come together with the other people and say, look, I'm going to call this man. And this decorated um, soldier, retired Major Alfred Paolo Conte, answer to the call of duty, to the call of the state, but only for ladies to return around. In other words, he was accused of taking a weapon to state house, a Glock, uh, a pistol to state house with 17 or 21 rounds. And the concluding talk, then I forgot kill the president, hence he was taken in and charged with treason. But even though that case, they captivate the audience, the nation, the international community, the diaspora, for something like two months on July 1st, which has predicated this particular um, um, bulletin. On July 1st, this man, retired Major Alfred Paolo Conte, was acquitted and discharged on the most serious of charges that were brought against him. Remember, 136 application was made to the High Court on the 29th of May against him. So the rest then we left, 24 months, now you get for serve some prison sentence. So like I say, we get Mr. Kutubu Koroma here and we get Superman Mohammed Kamara. Mr. Kutubu Koroma, just straight to the question. Do you see this as a vindication of the justice system, which many, and that I will dare to say, including you, was calling for some, for some um, action, legal action to be taken against um, retired Major Paolo Conte, and so forth and so on. Do you see this as a vindication that we are turning a new call, that this is a new beginning in terms of how we know the justice system, Nasir Ali? If there's anything within our soul, the answer to this now, I think for time for me, very good friend, I'm like contact for take to call. Me a culpa. My dad was a me a culpa for this. As we go along, we will we'll expand on that. If anything, enough for take me a culpa for being part and parcel of something, we don't be even supposed to be. I see the extraordinary juxtaposition of irony and contradiction on Ian Pat. One time he was front and center using all kind of argument, all kind of argument. But then by, an, by a, remark, I mean a remarkable irony, he now take a position where he seems to forgive the ambience of being a man, somebody who believe in the sanctity of human life. So this is not so much about I'm a Conte. It is now more about Ablai Conte. New argument from start to end that they will go as to the road. Then at the point I will give a historical and call up where treason begin as alone, who that they bring treason them, and the length where they may go to for make sure say anybody they put treason for them, you know, they convict them. Like now, yeah, new argument will go that we will look at the historical trend of this. So back to you. Okay, thank you very much. Just before I go to the next guest, I want even though you promised we will expand on that along the way, but we know say mia culpa now some Latin phrase inside law where they talk about um, some kind of fault of a person. Are you accusing Dr. Um, Abdullah Conte of the man being at fault in this case? Is that what you are aiming at? Well, okay. As we go, I would as we go, I mean, as we go, I would decide it. First, like, no, I'm quick to your part. Then again, like I say, me no go participate in this argument. If I not go back, I not go back from history. I will never, because we would, we would deny the, 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 the audience, you know, actually what they're supposed to know. We just not go to the end of this thing now. No, no, this has nothing to do with Palu Kote. It has to do with the concept itself, that the concept itself. So again, like I say, this is where actually now a black country is going to ask himself that, where do I say? Because at one time, he was front and center in a case we actually lost in the way into the loss of life sin. And we see the length where he go to. And like we say again, the irony here is the case where he been defend the case is then 
the uh, the, um, the the reports were that they found uh, arms and uh, people they host. But that was treason. That's why I think because uh, now I mean the one way he prosecute, the one way he defend somebody care and uh, um, uh, um, uh, arms go down and and, and state house. But if we look at um, uh, treason, if we go back for uh, treason, actually na na a, na a criminal disloyalty. That that would be actually one of the treason, uh, a criminal disloyalty. You know, to a nation, I didn't call them, and then you get various um, categories. Uh, as we go along, we will explain it categories. Uh, okay. which is actually, I don't know, teasing. Now, do you get high teasing and you get a um, uh, minor teasing, whatever, okay, then we'll talk which you will do for them within LN Sunday. So, back to you, sir. Okay, thank you very much. Um, uh, Mr. Mohammed Supermed Kamara, um, obviously, we know the case we did before we today, we know where it started. We all follow this case diligently. And um, as much as was expected, it is true that some people are very much disappointed, very, very much disappointed at the outcome. But so it's the same thing again, that some people are overjoyed and delighted, family members, friends, and the rest of it, of the, um, um, I, I, the accused man. But in terms of the way we look at with judiciary, in terms of the way we understand with justice system, do you see this you know, yeah, as a new turn, like a leaf is being flipped over you know, like Mr. Kutubu say, um, the past, of course, we had a murky past regarding justice in the country. But now, you know, yeah, this has come as a surprise to many. Do you really think that this is a new beginning in the way justice will be dispensed henceforth in the country? Okay, thank you very much, uh, Bola Prince Amit Kuma. And I want to say good evening and, or good morning or good afternoon to the viewers then. Um, this particular case, we get for look um, in different in, in its context. I know say uh, my fellow panelists, um, Kutubu can like for make light of history, which is very, very important because history, the chichui as how we go forward, we saw we come out and how we look things in the in a different capacity. Now me want to look this particular treason case and the context of multi-party democracy in our country. Yes, we don't get some certain different different category of governments then. Where we get one party state, we get military uh, um, government, and all those in a different category, in a different context. This is our allow look at in the context of multi party democracy. I still believe, say, there are plenty, plenty things them at play we make we arrive at which we arrive at soon. Because many people, and the question of plenty, plenty, Sierra Leonean said, they be hooked by this trial because they find them fascinating. Not forget to get now a, a first time account of people that will be there behind the scenes. But we don't know what in, what in transpire. Say, come to this case here. We know, say, the president in himself, according to the level source we get, is that he not only just called Paolo Conte and in team for camp for can help for the, for presumably for comfort against the COVID 19 coronavirus, he was advised by international NGOs there. What we don't do in a salon during the Ebola pandemic, they still advise them say, we get people in this country, get people in this country, we don't get first experience for first pandemic. The likes of Paulo Conte and others, their names were mentioned. So, then people that go good, then you bring and come back because they don't get the vast experience and expertise. Maybe you can't team up with you, that will make you fight against this city if you for in this country very, very effective. So we always need to understand that context there, where this thing come out from. And the case at hand, what they talk about. This high treason charge is where this man faced. And we also go for take into consideration, say, this man has 63, 64 years old man. We don't serve in a big, big office in the previous administration. Now possibly we don't need a limit with fast experience and so on and so forth. And we see the account where instead of take the witness box, now the court say where instead say give, where it put point by point what it actually happened. And now, as the case don't pass, we we'll get plenty, plenty, plenty more information when they build up. So what it mean? Who that mean they give the credit? But what we see so, because any team in a very religious person, I believe say the first credit they go to God. God said the verdict get for this. And no mortal man, I don't believe, say, where God don't say something. No mortal man, but we, not be able to change what God don't say. 
So the first um, credit we gave to God, we tell Papa God thank you for that because we patriotic and progressive Sierra Leoneans say we let for see fairness and justice in that country. Mm -hmm. Regardless of who that is not power or not. Then the next I will give the credit, a part of God, will go to the Jews them. I feel say the Jews them, they listen attentively and they know say the responsibility when they give them is very, very, very important. And people them, a person in life, they at stake here. So I think say they take into consideration the evidence thoroughly as presented to them. And then, then they arrive at the, the decision where they arrive at. Where plenty of Sierra Leone and say, yes, whatever you get for talk about this man, whatever you get for talk about the previous administration, this is not the just uh, 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 waiting call the jury they arrive at, according to plenty, plenty of Sierra Leone and Then the other people, they want to give credit. They go say, three. Now the, the defense council, the defense team, where compass of most of the, the most outstanding legal brain the whole country don't ever see. The likes of Dr. Abdullah Oponte, where we don't see expertise, not only in us, I don't know more. Even at a country like the Caribbean and Belize, where they go to the right, put the judiciary together. And subsequently, all what they don't do over the years. And also that plenty of good, good people have been in that team day. The way how they professionally, how they, 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 they tactically present the case, step by step, from the pre trial, where many people in the Belize say, even in presentation and pre trial, if not for some of the magistrates, maybe one way or the other, they're under pressure. They're not for be send that case, they're going to high court. So I think, say, if they ask me, say, why make this come so? I go to talk, say, then three factors in there. Papa Godway, and then they look after we all, we don't say this, then they happen. Nobody in the good Then the jurors then will take the bold step. Okay. For arrive at a just verdict. Then okay. also the legal team will eloquently make the case for the client. I believe say that the key body they were were really responsible for the acquittal of this man as you when a retired major at Paulo County. So right. if they ask me in relation to the justice system, I mean, there are many questions to be asked. Because we know plenty, plenty allegations a day against even sitting judges that will go the country. OK, OK. So that, I think so we'll go to Instagram as we go along. Thank you very much. And uh, Mr. Kutsubu, just for bring a point where the last speaker, your fellow panelist, used, which is, it looked like, say, the um, defense team is the greatest defense team ever assembled on the face of the Sierra Leonean uh, landscape in terms of the subject matter. If this is the case, you are in agreement with that. Do you think that they were able to influence the case for seek an outcome which they desire and which other people didn't? You mean it up? The, 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 I mean, it's thrown two days down, so I really you know pick up. Oh, you know, pick up the car. Yeah. Any, any, any yeah. better? Okay, it did down too much. Let's see what is going on. It did down too much. Okay, is there any better, sir? Is it clear? Any yes, clear? at the end now, yeah. It gets much better now, yes. Uh, okay, uh, no worries at all. So, I'll be saying, I'll take a question to you, which the last speaker, you know, yeah, um, put in a part of in position where you just make, in position where you just take, which is, as we don't hear it from certain quarters, and a great many quarters, that this is now one of the grandest, the biggest, the toughest um, defense team, defense council team ever put together with the lead counsel being Dr. Abdullahi O. Conte, a man which, with whom you have, you know, your vast disagreement from within we don't see um, from your broadcast. If this is the case and you are in agreement, you think, say, this team be able to influence the case for this desired outcome of theirs, where other people are not so desired, they may expect something else. You think, say, now this team absolutely responsible? Will you give them the 100% not say they are responsible for winning this case? It is not a question of whether or not we desire results. But then the other thing in we have worked upon, we, 
we don't seem for transmogrify a black country in this to this um, uh, Sir Patrick Hastings. Now in a the now in a the um, uh, how they call it of jurisprudence as salon, which is actually not the case. But in any case, I mean you know go take an intellectual pedigree. But for put a black country in this context as if now in actually none of the Sir Patrick Hastings of jurisprudence as salon are final. Just totally ludicrous. But so aside, why, 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 why? Because this is not a question Ralph will be bring to you. Look, well, since you bring we, yeah, we'll get to that. Yeah. We'll get to that. Well, as far as we're concerned, we have a lot of eminent lawyers in us, I know. So Such as? I agree, but on the okay. pedigree, well, we know that they know not, but, but don't let me waste time on the law, get to the point. Okay. If we agree on the fact, say, I like to say not to know the Sir Patrick Hastings of jurisprudence as alone, and we get equally eminent lawyers in a salon, then we need for, you know, go beyond that. Waiting, okay, okay. I really want to happen, and like I say, I don't go allow me on me on part, this discussion, no go. We not go go beyond that. I mean, me, not a student of the late Edmund Bock. I'm a student of him. Let, yeah. let God have a color. Me being a student of him, meaning that I learned a lot from a work step. And one of the things that we are learned from Edmund Bock, he said, then one day we don't remember yesterday, then go all this repeat the same mistake today. And me hold on to that lead to me. Very strong now. One of the guiding principles in that for hold on to that doctrine is say I will never attempt for good before we are not behind what they happen. Now we want to ask yourself, why is it an asylum? Every little thing that it reason. We need for also look into that. Not for not to do for half no more. Oh, yeah, Dr. Black country go now cut even victim. No, 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 no. Because the same Dr. Ablai country, we would all make this um, uh, Sir Patrick Hastings as a Now, the same Ablai country is where stand on tainted evidence, represent tainted evidence, it go to every leg for convict people. But then, at the same Ablai country now, one for be seen as a man we believe in the sanctity of him, 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 uh, human life. Now, make a bit of this This major actually in a, in a, in a, an eloquent indictment of Ablai country. And if I not time that for let it take me a court, but oh, guess what? I went to every leg for well, me why, to, why, uh, why try why try for staying the money achievement as an eloquent lawyer and a winner in this particular case by trying for draw parallel with case where happened 20, 30 years ago, to which he was only doing his due diligence as per the responsibility we've been get then. Okay, the question to you, the question to you is that. If in toxic, if in toxic, this case you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, I mean, rise to the level of treason. If in toxic, so, let's say we hold on to that view. Then the yeah. fundamental question we will ask I me: mean, waiting at the, I mean, waiting at the in the system, how the other case they rise I mean, to treason? Where okay, granted, yes, they meet weapons them now. Kai Kai, they was fine. We not go dispute that. But again, somebody also care weapon go now. How they call up? Wait, how he will come up for me, the man say, Kai Kai, then actually, I mean, I mean, for what in government. Okay, if he, if he don't establish that, I mean, that kind of an argument, say, yes, they really, they have the intent. How then we say, no, in fact, say, the go away, Palu Council, get credit, and if you want to assassinate the president, this name we call logic of syllogism. We not go, we not go cherry pick and lemon drop. If we accept the fact, say, Kai Kai, then really be one kill the other corner, we forget him. We shall be able to master the courage of conviction and moral fortitude and the intellectual honesty for admission. Palo Conte went to state house for assassinating the president. But if we say, oh no, not to that of intention, they will also hold on to the fact, not to the intention of Medan and others. But you see, we're not going to cherry pick and lemon drop. The thing are not good for we, for law, we know it's not going to happen. We have to consolidate everything into context and perspective. Now, like I say, we need to go back to the origins of treason, how it is. She's in case in the salon. And the only way that for long arrive at waiting with the talk about now. But no just jump that the middle now begin, you know, they transmogrify people and for be this kind of a utopia in everything now. I will not be part of that kind of a discussion. Okay. Um, thank you very much, Mr. Um, Koroma. Uh, Mr. Kamara, you've heard um, Mr. Kutubu. And um, it seems like um, um, Dr. Conte will have no chance to celebrate a victory now because they will have to will have to you know yeah look back will have to reflect but 
with the parallel there with Mr. Kutubu try for draw, will you agree with that one? A, there were weapons, according to him, found at GMT Kaikai and others. Weapons, weapons, okay? And with Mr. Um, with guitar Major Paolo, he also take a weapon to State House. Do you see any similarity then there, you know, yeah, in a wider perspective or just um, for the viewer then sake, is it a kind of narrow thought? What's your take? Okay, thank you very much once more again. And um, now the problem is where I say, what well, I begin everything, you look at me to context. I absolutely not see any uh, correlation between the two cases. First of all, the previous case where, the, where Mr. Kutubu they talk about, Abdullah Okonte was the lawyer for the state. The chief justice, I mean, the minister of justice, and to the minister of justice, now the lawyer for the state, for the, for the government. Then now, now in a defense council, so the whole thing, they differ. Now make any way they do, you get to look up into context. And again, the circumstances surrounding that case, they, like when you say clearly describe them, there were weapons and ammunition found. And there was a narrative, because I remember that time they waited to explain this to you and how this to be, be unraveled at the court. Many people from other side, they want to put the jigsaw together after thorough investigation. Now, you can disagree the, the outcome of that trial. It's up to you because uh, maybe you look at it to different, different angles. But for trial to make correlations, say that because of that trial, it not be, be, be honest, it not be fair. So that because of the people, they, they just go meet ammunition at the host no more. And where the loan as alone, they don't allow you to get ammunition in the first place. Now you host. That is very, very important. So let me say anything, take the context of her. The, the, the law that the country cannot allow you to get short ammunition and the intent and the thing where they unravel, the plot where they unravel, the plotters in, where they be able to gather all come together and say that this will happen, the witness where they bring her. And a blind country as a person where they fed the case for the government, the government will win her. It do it utmost best for proof, say them people that are guilty. So that is one. Then this one now, look this case. The, uh, the, the, the accused go there on the invitation of the president. The accused go there with a Glock 17 pistol. We're not even loaded. The accused get in pistol, in back where it contains the pistol, in a reception. So if I can pause, if I can, if I can pause uh, excuse me, if I can pause you there and interject quickly on the basis that what I read from court document is like the pistol was loaded. It's a Glock 17 and was um, loaded. There's confusion around a brown bag, whether it was surrendered or whether um, the man tried for bypass um, um, the scanner or whatever. But he was um, on invitation from the president, but the pistol was loaded. Okay, thank you very much. Let me clarify for that loaded pistol. You can get for understand about firearms before you yeah. load a pistol. The piece you can get cartridge in the chamber, but you need to load it on the cock and then call loaded. That's okay. ready for, for, for trigger, for operate with them. Okay. But when they when you get cartridge in the chamber, it doesn't mean it's loaded. It gets a safety cap on. It doesn't mean it's loaded. You have to pull the safety cap, you, you set up. That means it's loaded. They don't they even clarify the argument was made in court and it was clarified. Then going forward, according to the, 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 the accused, and I believe that the jury is a believer, and I make the, 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 the acquittal. In Anovaram, um, saying I'm a piece to get you, and they go meeting. Because what you do, but when they watch me, I don't believe that I left this bag inside the motorcar. This man, now a carrier of weapon, because he, according to the, what they call, he license and legally get the right to carry weapon as a former defense minister. When no get security, that says uh, now a dereliction of duty, now the side of the state, because defense minister them, Forget security. So this man, all that circumstance they put together. And for let you know, say, this case get plenty, plenty anomalies. When this man go for this media, so when even the scary people they come meet him, interrogate him, they allow the man for like gonna host. Who say me you get serious ground for any treason case where we allow the accused for go first now or say, okay, we can't report back to man. These are all anomalies. They will not be there by them previous cases in the okay. previous cases in the way uh, Mr. Kutubu they talk so people them they meet people them they meet ammunition. According to the information, we get pile of ammunitions. 
Okay. This okay. could be AK-47 and the likes and all those other heavy yeah, artillery. Ex exactly. So you take... see the, the, the differences, but the two cases are completely different. The okay, circumstances, Mr. the context, completely different in terms of the whole way Abdullah concept they take. So okay, I thank you, see, Mr. Abla Kamara. Was only doing his job for every government get case, for God and for God to for make an effective case, make the government winner. Okay, that point they take it. That point. Talk about the do now, yeah. Now for camp defending clients to the best of ability for free in client. Mr. So Kamara, I, I, I don't point, see the point, or the point note. The, 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 the inefficiency of a black country in your side. Hey, Mr. Kamara, point noted. Thank you very much. I'll take the same question to Mr. Kutubu that um, from the, your fellow panelists, you can't draw a parallel between waiting happen uh, to major retired, uh, the basis on which major retire uh, Paolo was um, charged with treason as opposed to GMT Kaikaida when are the cooks of your own um, um, argument. Will you go along with waiting the last panelist, Jesse? You find weapons, automatic weapons, as opposed to a single weapon being taken you know, here to the state house. Will that rise up to um, a treason? You know, though, Mr. Coleman? Yes, sir. We go resort to all kind of a moral equivalence there. Okay. All kind of a defense from those two down from January to December. The alpha and omega of this argument simply remains this. Anyhow, look up. Palo can take care, go and go to the state house. Period. Whether I get permission for what I call them, for do this. A misnomer in the scheme of things. Now that they call, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a moot, I'm a moot point that. Moot point. If Anes Koma be sit on a state house, anybody can go go in and a different thing. Now make us a minimal continue this discussion until I go back to this day. Because waiting, me a very good friend, he can't do now. If they can't lay this crown and a column making a black country the utopia of, of a, 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 a intellectual mm -hmm. and, 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 and mm -hmm. antecedents, you don't hear all this. I know a black country more than how in one. I don't interact with a black country. A black country don't offer me job, I'm not a cam. I don't see that a black country talk. Even when we be working at the Justice Department, when we try a phone case, I sit down with them across the table. I know a black country of all. Now, two a black countries, I mean, no, the, the group that we come on England, where everybody be negotiating on. Uh, all that if foods where they make a mean and the ablock country where 1977 where he joined politics zone are two ablock country we talk about now. Now when they talk about the ablock country where 1977, I can tell you about the ablock country before 1977. I can go with, along with everything they talk to the extent even one of the British the foreign minister and then what's this guy named Dr. David Owen, my personal friend Nandi. Everything we ablock country don't do in life, I don't follow up from Sanu to Gambia, to everywhere, I don't know. We talk about, so there's no way anybody will lecture me about a black content. I can write a whole book about that. Where do they talk about this? It, it remains this. And it, now, now me, as we argue, me go, go, be, we go back to my own history now. Mm -hmm. The first trees in case with Kana Salu, Brigadier David Lansana, what did they accuse them for? Say it prevent APC from taking power. They go like the, and uh, Shaka Siri said, um, uh, he said, um, uh, earlier, we have to bring up. We didn't bring up. What didn't happen? They charge him. Only Justice Foster and I sit up on the case. No, they don't put you on the Only Sam Foster. Then the next thing, somebody, where they may not put come on a law, we law. CBO just right. Now they make, say, let me the prosecutor. This will show, waiting, you know, how they may not determine. Okay, fast forward. We go to the case of Block Sinde. Not the same case, is it? Fast forward, we go to the case of Elako Gulamas and others. To the extent, the, the prosecutor, the same prosecutor where the top of CBU just said, he take five, he goes sit down in England, he left the case, you know, let people they in a jail up to three years, they the language in a jail. Now, in turn, they will. All right, now, now, now go to, we, we man a black country, now, now bring an ayah. Since Naina, the how they call an ayah, when they go to the story for now, all that slow good. <laughs> Okay. Oh man, the, the, whatever it was, it was against Kamaratelo. Kamaratelo. It was not even against S.I. Kuma. So if that the argument, they would put so. When, um, 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 when, they, when Shaka Stevens asked the then Attorney General for um, for, for brief treason case on foreign and others, eh? the Attorney General then, he looked at the thing, he said, no, 
this way after so you know you know rise to treason you know that he begin to argue shaka series begin argue and me and me bua now ask an e and two who done the lawyer now it can happen say earlier bua been get for go na conference the law of the sea as you come on the night put any people play waiting any people to ibrika a black country was in the justice department the fundamental question was asked a black country when they where will not all come up when will not look up Anywhere be there, you begin the moral compass, the ethical foundation, and the intellectual honesty for saying, you know what, Mr. Attorney General, we believe say this is not rise to treason. A black court be answered. No, waiting up on each front and center in the prosecution. Even when you begin lawyers, they will senior to an place, people like Andy Tijan Kulen, people like Akibaba, them, and other people. It take front and center in the prosecution of uh, uh, for that day. Fine. Now fast forward. We go to meet that case. They come up with all this charge, you say, oh yeah, they do the fine. To the extent we 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 all follow the finger pointing, the Lucifer will betray the country. That's what you refer to me now. As a Lucifer will betray the country, and I want when the case talk, what you have like country. This man will not make the utopia of education or nice people pass everybody in a salon. What you do in the next year, he turn around, he take me that job. He take a job after he don't maliciously prosecute a man to death. But this man with all this brown education, he thought they call He see that's what they call ethics, or that's what they call conflict of interest. That not be part of the education at all. Not. With all the Cambridge ed education, not be he turned around, he take me that job. Um, okay. The alpha and omega of this argument, what should now we need for the Lord, Lord left for this? Because every time you Come for make a black country the God. I don't go agree. I go bring them down. What do we now need for do? We need for ask yourself whether in fact we need treason, treason a, 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 a statute that we book. Now that now that we wait to now 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 for now for beginning to talk about how go make sure we not get this kind of obnoxious laws and our clause. Because I can tell you with any degree of certainty, the government say both sides, SFPP and APC, then they use treason cases for go against their passive enemies. Right in question, this case against part of culture should never have been a, a case of treason. That thank I can you. tell you any thank amount you. of honesty. I'll tell you thank that. you. Thank you very much. That not be the man get a weapon, weapons strike. That's all. Thank you very that much. Never been a case of treason. And that makes me for ask you the following okay. question exactly. But that's how the government said you quit. So me go rather prefer no move away from this try for big defense on this. Let us see how we come with solutions then. No, but um, Mr. Kutubu, you are absolutely right. But now you did do all the historical antecedents, them all inside this uh, program, you know, here for make a comparative analysis to the then and now, which is good. But a precedent apparently has been set, and that is where we're supposed to move on further. But um, it seems like um, Dr. Abdullahi Okonte, me and you grew up now in Sierra Leone, where the victors were congratulated. You know this very well. And he's a professional, he's an academic, and um, he's a scholar, he's written many, many, he's authored many, many books. Many, many things then I get for do with with Lord and today he gets something for do with him. And this now we know. The idea, I want to ask you this question because you make reference to the then. If Dr. Priscilla Squartz had won this case, because now we get the benefit of hindsight, uh, Rita Major Paolo Conte, the highest charge they would have put on him, okay? It's been, it's been um, acquitted on, on the charges then. They, but yet, the state prosecuted them, led by the Minister of Justice, now in even the call for, for the highest uh, 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 treason, crime of treason. So assuming, because you talk a lot of hypothetical and thesis, assuming that this thing be happened to Paolo Conte, that he was going to face a conviction, or he was convicted, would you be making the same case against Dr. Priscilla Squads that the evidence not mount up to you know your serious crimes or high treason? Would you? If you listen to me, I a lot of broadcasting. I don't repeatedly talk about the facts. We don't need it. it on the face of that, whatever evidence we will come with, and I don't go sit on that. I talk to you know that I will be intellectually or morally dishonest. Whatever verdict before come up with acceptor because none are the value. But the question is now the right things that are the question we get, we have for now go beyond the verdict. 
Because now that then I think so the view of say we get for accept them ipso facto. But we now need to go further. Do we need this kind of a thing? And then I mean, I tell you earlier, say both government and both APC and SFPP they, they use treason as you know weapon for go against the passive enemies them for shut them down for eliminate them. Now I, mean, I go back when MF one of them they say that SI Koguma be they go na Justice Marcos court in, in chamber every day with that they go they go to Justice Marcos court every day they go there. Why a vice president for they go see? It's a judge. What do they go see for? So the argument here remains. Uh, yeah, before I accept a Priscilla shot, George Equay I accept this. But now the thing is, do we want this every now and then and a politician and they use treason them for go against a passive enemy? America when America, they don't get treason. The most they will charge you for an espionage, you they spy against the state. They don't kill Kennedy now. Yeah? They kill now. the government of the United States continue. November 22, 1963, na, na, na Texas, the government continue. The government don't go. They don't shoot M M M Reagan, na, yeah? the government continues. So we need for the see now what's going happen at the industrialized country then they, We don't need that kind of a case then they, on both sides, either SFPPO, APC, we don't need them. Okay. If like weapon, so, charge the man care weapon, charge them for weapon. But not bring capital so, case on them. That na mio so argument. You, so on both sides, I don't accept both of them. Both SFP they own as well as APC. Yeah, the verdict where they come from, that's fine because the verdict of the day. But could we accept that? No. You go live with that? No. We need for change the narrative. Now me contribution on that. So thank you very much, sir. Um yeah, so if we get for look at things historically, which you're very good at, we not go bring American, you know, your sort of um governance style in a salon because of course. The colonial that was Britain and everything else that we've been doing so far and so on is Britain. High crimes of treason, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. The court system, the laws, the statutes, and etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But this comes to you, Mr. Um, Mr. Kamara. Um, obviously, the prosecutor them. I agree with Mr. Kutubu anyway. 110 percent, if mathematically possible, that um, we need for look further. We need for look forward. In other words, it happened for look like say, a precedent has been set because many people were of the opinion that Paolo Conte is toast, he's a done, he's done. I don't really agree with that because the point of view where people let me they make us at the time is now he make there are contradictions in terms of the judiciary where suddenly some people think that it's now clean. It's now, you know, yeah, independent. Why do I say this? Because one, like Kutubu say, this not amount to treason. So there shouldn't have been treason at all. Hence why people when they call for the head of the Minister of Justice, the, uh, 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 the AG, for go. Because now input the case, and in a criminal case, you get for no say the case can for be watertight or close to watertight. But in this case, it wasn't. Yet then decide for present the case. And one can theorize all you can about it is because there'll be some kind of um, aforementioned, you know, yeah, sort of feeling that, um, well, we've got this case, we are the rulers, we are running the country, so therefore we can put the case forward and we will come out of it, you know, victorious. But something happened, and that's something that will happen. Now, one for let you take us through. How did we arrive, you know, at a uh, 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 jury them, um, they acquit Paolo on the most serious of cases? The reason why they bring this to you, because you said something which is very critical to this evening's discussion, which is, okay, Paolo, assumably, uh, assumedly, go to the place day with a gun and bypass. We don't say go with a gun, but the bypass becomes a question. If a man been go there for go commit treason, kill the president, because this is what he amount to, kill the president, do a coup, then how come they left this one man, you know, here for go and it take a few days before then finally, you know, here Brian come to the law? So I want to let you deal with this in a wider context for we, based on waiting the, uh, the, pan the other panelists say, and uh, Usa, you been to come up from before I went to Kutumu. Okay, then thank you very much, Mr. Oh. Brother Prince. And no, no, not to you, Kutumu, and Mohammed. Yeah, well, are they you you much, but, um, yeah, go on. Prince again, a uh, very, very, very important um, um, question you ask you because now, um, now that make 
people and be so tied to this case because now we don't get plenty accounts. But before I church Padawale force, I will say, uh, uh, Mr. Kutubu, in the critique of um, Dr. Abla Okonte, he used plenty, I know say yes, by virtue of his age, it's a bit, maybe it's a bit, uh, Paolo Ponte, maybe they all go school together. But what's the deal with that? And in fact, as I was seeing, I know I use um, um, assumptions or, or what they call or hypotheticals for, but in fact, as how they state them, now I mean they go along with. I know say I not be there, I not be old to that extended for them. They do it all in ten a day, but all in ten, and I see what I don't look into, and I bring the fact, and I make a, 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 a but it's just a, a, a real judgment and see, say, well, this now, so this will happen, and so this will happen. Now, we don't move by the case of um, um, this Paolo Conte. Like we are saying now, we don't get plenty, plenty of facts. We don't know, say, even the president, not just Cap no more, he called Paolo Conte, say, make it can join them for this uh, uh, COVID 19 fight. Now, recommendation they make to one, say, I NGOs they say, but we don't need this country. The last time I get a pandemic now, the people will be outstanding for FETAM, then they are the country, then team day. Would they advise you, make you bring them on board, make you work with them, because they get the experience and the expertise. If this thing can have a country, you don't know FETAM. So that this advice the president will take where he invites Paul to consult. Now, like what you say no more, with all the things that we go on at State House, where Paolo Conte, then go meet him there, the other people, and go meet him and they say, well, now you get this thing, he accepts it, and they get the call and left him, I'll be there for a security guard, we'll say the camp and meeting, all that has been established. Now, then people are saying, okay, now what are you going to host them, we'll call you back. Then go to host, go interview him, like host them. Then left and they say, okay, we'll call you back, this is not to anything anyway, but we'll call you back, we'll go to the side, we'll wait, wait, wait and go, we'll call you back. Then the following day, then they call him back for going. I said, when they go interrogate and detain him. You know, then he took him back away and me fell the panel is a talk just on the air. So he make example for the assassination of Kennedy and his trial. I believe it's two different assassination, where sometimes I hate this president or I dare against this president, I assassinate him. Now, one thing, then a treason, now where there is a conspiracy for top of the regime, pull the regime or a government in power. So that the government where I want, or me will be a part of another government where can take power. So that the two distinct difference that one day. So now let me take this for instance. Now, 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 now this case here, this treason, I treason when in charge for all the country. That like the insinuation now they say they want to assassinate the president so that APC will take power. But that is way far from the truth because we know say according to the 1991 Constitution we salon the Jews. If they assassinate the president, automatically the next person will take over. Now the vice president. And the vice president will be the vicinity vicina today. So whatever will be happening there, now both, now both because Paolo will come legitimately say we'll overthrow the government. It was so, it, 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 it makes no sense. The circumstances around the whole case makes no sense for plenty, plenty Sierra Leoneans. Say, but the president over 60 bodyguards. With every machine gun, they came for some all kind of food. This man within Glock 17, where the highest level will find at 17. You know, like the suicide is beyond suicide mission. How this man will go full up, full day for go past short term mission. Okay. And if even if we succeed, who's benefit when this go back to empathy? There will be no benefit to empathy. Because waiting the quite the 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 of succession. From the president, they go to the vice president. The vice president, they go to the speaker, and all the people are the SFPP people. So there's there's no way where the APC will take power to the means they So this all now come together with plenty of Sierra Leone and say, "Oh, this case no get no merit for going to court." And the way out the end of the case, they say, "You no get no merit." Now we don't know say there were backroom meetings will take place. Whether well, let's say take place. Key and stalwarts in our government, we say, no, this man, we from use him as an example, for make an example of him, so that maybe we go silent, we go, maybe they see him say, now wait for silent opponent, or now wait for make sure they all must succumb. But what's in favor, and I make a little for to Mr. Kutubu say, the context have changed. Now we get multi party democracy. And not say they make example for Sheikh Stephen. That was a one party system of governance, not to be democracy that one day. Now be one party system of governance where be there where even the SFP will be part of that governance. 
It wasn't just it wasn't just APC. Most of the key SDP people, when they defeat them, they all can change it. Make that one that one party system there at the country. You know, the likes of Joe Jackson, the likes of Salia Jusha, Mina and others, they all have yet, they all can join. So the context is different. And now we get multi-party democracy and accountability on this more. The world don't move on. The international community, they play very, very key role. Then they see okay. what's in the happen. And accountability day. Just okay. the other day, I was seeing a social media say, one of the ministers, one of the survey agents, where can I go? They, they, they don't arrest them. Okay. For crimes, when they believe, say, in contribute, where the government be in a power. So all of them see, people know them. The judges, they say, no one. You see, okay. all of them see, contribute for what you see by the outcome of this case. Okay, now, Mr. Mr. Kamara. Now, this is to vindicate, say, the justice system, the government don't interfere upon them. But again, yeah, we can't we can't we can't we can't do that we can't we can't do that um okay thank make you I just, yeah make i just go quickly uh to kutubu um mr kutubu from waiting the other panelists just say it appear as if this is a colossal failure on the part of the prosecuting team will you agree with that characterization day of the prosecuting team because the city judge justice uh, just steven talk about you know you're prosecuting the case you get forget a watertight case and from the beginning, if we go by waiting on or to say the panelists, then it seems like um, there was no case of treason, but yet still that end was pursued. So, do you think that this is a colossal failure on the part of the prosecuting um, team, sir? Thank you. I can say everything they do now is in a conjecture. Everything they do, they all. Because for one thing, the case has been, they not lit 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 litigate the case already. So whatever they do in academic, in conjecture, in opinion, um, the other they may distinguish Germany and the will continue for arguing your case or another problem. So also I will stand on my own premise. <laughs> you know, I will stand on my own premise. And like luckily, God make you be using what a president, I recall that. And uh, Mr. Conte is lucky enough, perhaps common sense, prevail over opportunistic calculations on the part of the US. Even though the court they talk so without disclosing. I just don't talk to somebody in uh, the Justice Department at uh, the Attorney General Office. He don't send me something we mean they go on a social media ask him. He don't give me, he, he replied, well, I know we'll name the, the, the lawyer where I talk to in the Justice Department. I get reply now. But we go wait. Let hopefully let the information come on at the We go they don't all go way in about them saying it. But waiting we are in uh, because I hear by woman. And me know I go by woman now and I ask. And he was kind enough for replying me. When they do the investigation, come on, I don't they will come up for now. But for now, don't be clear, you know, if it be no waiting in the top 20, I mean, no address this case again. Now we always don't you know, admit the facts see, from 1968, which is the case that's not to now, all not be a mistake enough for happen. Let, let we all embrace that enough for happen. Yes, individuals have committed crimes. These crimes should be dealt with. But Lord Lord Sidon has we justify one, say, oh, because not be a this are the corner be that, that no 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 no. <laughs> what do that would all result again to moral equivalence or, or, or whatever it is? Let me accept the facts. See, treason actually the, the weight man they will come up with treason. I make a treason not in either. If there's any time for charge anybody with treason now, during the civil war, where the, the confederate forces them. Rise against the United States when they do that day. because part of treason are also extreme and uh, extreme and uh, acts where you, you, you bring one a country, you rise against the leader, you kill the leader, you do this, you do that. You do. We get a whole range of that. We come up to high treason, but since we're not gonna, we're not gonna wait till we, we God make within a kind of place that's all the profile the opinion. Let we now use there, it don't be world on land. Let people look at yes. Everybody glad in the country, you know, with a sigh of relief. Yes, at least Mr. Court said God don't make something. This now they be I mean, a roadmap for government and let them be very careful not to everything small thing you don't care, excuse in case go in where the policy in life go in. We also need for acts with parliament because, like they always say, the job of parliament now not job now for make laws for a whole year is and investigate. Parliament need for come inside this for look at that part of the act and see if they can amend them. That's not one of the things they, because we don't know, God forbid, what is another thing happening again. 
would get to get so that person will be lucky as a, a, a Mr. Cotton. We're not getting then guaranteed it. So we all job that for me, he advocate, say no, we don't need this because the politician then they use treason as a weapon for go after they perceive enemies. In. They will come up with flimsy things. In. We don't add up. Deep down in your heart, if not me, not be, I mean, I mean, so me be then at the bureau in government and you said, right there, I mean, for stand up to the attorney general and say, no, no, no. Now, weapon, the man can't go that. What well, a true that don't see the weapon, are they going let me bring weapon strike on this man there. So, and the magistrate, where if I see don't find this case here, this is where we talk about the, the, the president of the judge. Right there, the, 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 the magistrate, the, 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 the magistrate, before just not, you know, dismiss, it is a part of this. And deal with the weapons that that is before him. He should never have committed this case out to the high court. He should. Well, yeah, but Mr. Kutubu, um, sorry, I mean, you will continue, but I just want to bring. Uh, hello, Mr. Kutubu, you hear me, sir? I hear you, sir. Yeah, it's just a quick one because um, this is the thing. You see, the, the thing about social media and broadcasters and etc., there is a record. It's almost like a slog. That's the young of a snail. So you know, say where they begging self in the left mark. So now the same thing number which we were the top na media. So there's a lot of things said over that period of time by you regarding the particular case. So you seem it, it seems like um, you are you are moving away from your original position. And secondly, you talk about conjecture and conjecture as some opinion or something way um, um, and not complete. So when they talk about academic opinion or theories and not complete. But in this case, we get the benefit of hindsight. We know what's in the case now, there's an outcome. So this is no longer conjecture. We could say that we they talk on, we, why would they weigh on opinions, but facts also relevant and facts are there. The case has been dismissed in terms of the treason because we know treason did not happen. That we can agree on, isn't it, sir? Okay. The, the, again, the case on the, this now we call, now I make a call a money, money quarterback in order. <laughs> yeah. we, hope, we all begin with opinion prior to the litigation of this case here, before the litigator. But if we say we believe in the rule of law, we believe in the independence of the judiciary, we get for the honest, you know, are they go back, the OJ Simpson case. Like you read that in. When you actually look at from a perspective, there's a great chance that OJ Simpson will do that case. Then now we all opinion on that. But try people, they say, oh no, you not do that. Now the question we get for, we, we, we get for continue for argue that table, Twelve people, ordinary people, them. This is where and, 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 the, the, the great Magna Carta come in. The importance of the Magna Carta, where and, 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 and King John, he and then begins to become, let her give rights to citizens. I should say, you remember that thing will be happy now, Ronnie Mead, So, this yes, is the importance of Magna Carta. Law give rights to citizens. The man, he has had his day in court on treason. The man has been freed. So what we need now for we don't need for her for this anymore. Whether we get opinion opinion or not, yeah, I had my own opinion. I don't go. I, I'm and, not a, a very a very opinion. strong a very yeah. strong one as well. Yes, I had my opinion, but now guess what? The court your opinion supersedes me your opinion. Waiting twelve ordinary people they so. So even if you catch us, yes, I had a very strong opinion about the thing. But the question is, that opinion matter now? No, the opinion has been vanquished. By waiting 12 ordinary citizens in the state. So they learn from waiting 12 ordinary citizens in the state. We move from that plan. We learn, say, you know what? We need a kind of mean a solution now. The prophylactic measures say we will address 30 and say, we not go happen. This is where I mean they have for now solutions. Here. We for them part, we impeach them. You guys will need for change that law. They even then, BB country, England, America, they don't get treason anymore. They still get away when they will bring case on you. If you tell for about the other, you know, they, so now that I want to use them platform here for talk about that. Because you know, say, you know, a black content was the Sapati cases. That's a lot fine. <laughs> we will cancel no. It's not the Sapati cases. You got people okay. there also. Okay, Mr. Guzu. And this is the point. Basically, legal brilliance. So, yeah. so, so all that again become an academic. It become an academic issue. So me go rather prefer now spend time dealing with solutions. Enough, yeah, exa exactly. And solutions are one for that we talk about, but notwithstanding, um, you seem to have a sympathy, you know, yeah, for this prosecution team. And you seem to have, you know, yeah, like um, a dislike, if you would like, for Dr. Abdullah O. Conte. Well, for anyway, I don't like, I mean, again, like the OJ seems to be, people had a lot of sympathy for, you know, the, the, the prosecutors, and because in the hearts of her, 
they, they lay down their case. They lay down their case. Fine, we all hear it. But again, when they go back to the alpha and omega of, of the argument, 12 ordinary citizens they say, oh, yeah, we don't hear it. But no, that's in the, not to say it be. Okay. Yeah, but again, we can go on and on again to the OJ case, historically speaking. It's a case that I followed. It's a case that I follow up to this day. It's like the law was meted out and waiting happen is OJ is a free man. And OJ free on the basis of the law that was being dealt with. But there was um, there was eagerness on the part of the prosecution team okay. to hold a OJ responsible and made many blunders along the way. The gloves, the, the, the murder gloves. OJ and very big. He can't even Why? go inside the gloves. How can he? So anyway, that's the beauty. Law also, if you understand, say in law, in law also they are sweating a call. When when the judge the sum of the judge, they tell you this, it is in law. They tell you say, as soon as they consider this case that I have so if una, any doubt, if any doubt where you get in the mind about the culpability of this person, please find for him. Like happen. Yes, they care all these hats, they care the gloves, everything. But like I said, that old dictum will say if you get any doubt in your mind, any doubt, just find for the defendant because he better let we let 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 we, let, 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 let the guilty person let it go free, let it go scot free than the innocent person. I have yeah. always said okay. that. Okay, it sounds almost near impossible. Like OJE, if you do a self in one grain of the duam, and for like commodity gloves can't fit, and then at the same time jump inside in Bronco Jeep with your friend Al and go on a wild chase, you know, here yeah, with FBI agents, everybody. It's a it's a it's the beauty of the law. Uh, Mr. Kamara, um here, here, here we go. Do you think that this is a colossal failure on the part of the prosecution team? Remember, Justice Ja talk about having a watertight case, which no one needs to be told about. Because of course, when you talk about a criminal case, your case get for be watertight. But just like um, your fellow panelists, Mr. Kutubu Koroma, they say now, and I agree yourself, they say the same thing. This was a case, and I make your program yesterday was titled, The Trees in Trial That Never Was. So how will they allow you know, such a case you know, for go forward? So don't you think that this is a failure on the part of the prosecution team, especially the justice minister, Dr. Priscilla Schwartz? Normally, in a, in a state you know, um, um, where the rule of law is paramount, is critical, somebody head will have to rule on this basis because this is not an embarrassment for the government. Do you think the same? Absolutely. In fact, Brother Prince, um, I think say this now a colossal failure of biblical proportion where wow. in terms of the justice system, in terms of cases in our country we will ever see. Again, many say alunians say, with a common sense, this not even with legal sense, because you know, say the question and my fellow parents have for talk. Now, any criminal case, then will only convict you beyond reasonable doubt. Now, civil case, I need to use the balance of probabilities. But any criminal case, they will only convict you beyond reasonable doubt. And any lame somebody, even somebody where at least get some issue within with thinking, go no say, this case here, in order beyond reasonable doubt. You see, so to make the, the Anthony General and some other stalwarts and the lead uh, prosecution team, the Anthony Wenner, Adrian Fisher, and others, go get the thinking, say, this kind of case, Go past na court and then go able to get a conviction. It is beyond everybody. Now, in the mystery, I mean, it's a problem. Why are afraid? Say, the only one of people that will get this thinking, now that's where the state go interfere by the case. Now, the only way that they will make plenty of Catalonians be get that thinking, they say, so what? Because this kind of case, the way you don't see the explanation and the circumstances, the context of the case, there is no way. Will anybody go able to get a conviction in, in, in front of the law? The only way we're able to get a conviction, unless the, 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 the judiciary or the people that deal with the case, they've been manipulated or some sort of interference take place. But again, I make a bit you say, I still need to give the credits to say the state no interfere. I still not give the credit say 
the judiciary is impartial, and they give the credit to three things that will be there to you. I said, becoming a religious person, I believe say anything, not God. God be don't say, this man, whatever I do, we are not going to go on for this particular circumstance, these particular instances. So God will protect them. Any kind of sense, any kind of plot when they get, God will block that plot, say, in all shape or form. So they make a believe, say, God, not that one. Then I also believe, say, the Jew will play a big, big role. I believe, say, the technical, very important. They know, say, the life of somebody, they not the end. And they not take the oath when they swear up at the Quran or the Bible lightly. They take a series so list in this case, thoroughly, or who gets any doubt, who cannot convict this man. And again, I the defense counsel come in. We get one of, I would say, one of the best put defense counsel I've ever seen in recent time in Sierra Leone. Okay. Whatever All happens, right. is one name on them. They make sure, say, when you follow the case, they methodically present the fact as it's supposed to be. Even yeah, when so... they call the, the lead accused for let's take the witness box, when they cross uh, examiner, the way I come across, the way they present them. Okay, okay. You so know, far, even uh, the judge says that Elijah Momoja Stevens was nearly in tears. Yeah, so okay, that says Mr. a Kamara. lot about the case. We are coming towards the end of the program, so I want to give everybody a fair shot. We get roughly about um, 15 more minutes. That's plenty of time of talk, but we will just um, slow on down a bit. And um, just go quickly to um, Mr. Kutubu Koroma. Um, obviously, some of the counts, you know, here on treason, I mean, the treasonous charges, the man was acquitted of them, which means that it never really happened. So, um, but he was held, I believe, on three different counts, one possessing, you know, yeah, some unlicensed weapon, and et cetera, et cetera. But the thing I find ironic in this, uh, Mr. Kutubu, if you can address this, is, is the man that will make the provision for the weapon, of the weapon, one retired Colonel Sa Atoni Sina, and um, one Prince George Jusu, were acquitted. Imagine this on the basis of possession of firearm, which is considered to be illegal, to which the man is now stand um, charged for possession of illegal firearm. But the people that we procure the weapon, we make the document, we sign it out to them. They are set free. They are free, effectively free. How you see this kind of thing, Mr. Kutubu? Explain them for we. We are breaking down to the audience for we, please. Takarim. Yeah, give me five, give me five minutes, yeah, I'll connect you. Okay. Yeah, hold the line. Could you there? You hear me? Um, yeah, you get the, how they call it, like, so, so I'm going to die in my cup. Okay, you're hearing the question, eh, because I hear you now. The question was? Okay, the question was, um, the, the uh, Paulo got freed or acquitted on the most serious charges, the ones of treason, which we all agree mm -hmm. never was there anyway. And um, but the lesser charges is, is a little bit serious, but when you consider the two, one is no longer there. This one are the lesser one, possession of firearm. And the people that we get the weapon, we issue the weapon, we sign the weapon to Ram. They went scot free. They are effectively free man them. But the retired major is now being held for the possession of illegal firearm. And they say, can you break down that for the audience for let me understand exactly how this play out, where the people that we get the weapon, we sell the weapon, we give the man the weapon, we issue the weapon, has no charges at all against them. They are free. But Paolo, is still being held responsible for this particular uh, uh, quote unquote unlicensed weapon. That, that the interesting paradox that we live with judicial system actually a laughing stock, really. But in particular, the folks that we sit on our justice department. Again, <laughs> like you say, okay, the man we get. Who say people them we actually know which they do, they're very focused. 
That being the case, then for charge them all with conspiracy. That should have been a conspiracy charge and that the chef for that weapon is how this man get this weapon, would I give this man weapon, I didn't show this weapon, waiting at the channel the way he passed. Not law assume for the supposition of assumption. See where the man not been go to the proper protocol for getting the weapon and who that get the weapon. All of the people are, should have be held accountable. Again, when you did not assist them, you know, this is not a systemic system. Something which you know happened so. Something uh, a, a, a Malawi business, now you know the really, really Malawi lights, now you know the sign of Salyun now, where tomorrow we'll go get to the more serious things, the more say elections, elections take place. You know, and uh, bound and call and come, kata kata come, with a look where, where will be our judicial, how judges then go day for make sure say they go come up with verdict them in harmony with the legitimate aspirations of the citizen. Yeah, this way council we're glad for them. We hope is this for be a stepping stone. We hope is this not for be a time where the judiciary is done, they, they, they reflect and ask themselves, look, we when they make when people like um, uh, John Locke them um, uh, by Montesquieu, they put government state together, they divide that into three equal parts. We find that the United States based system government. You know where they like write law, you know where they interpret this law, I mean, where they carry out the law, and you know where they tap. You guys, where the weather will black job, the only job on a get now for say we waiting and write now, yeah, we waiting and say we. Okay. We're going to court. No, okay. no, 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 opinion, no, 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 not a job that for right opinion. You just tell we say this way they are the corner, so you see. So in other words, the America, where to go over the right tolerate there, judicial okay. activism, they're not a tolerate and they are. Okay. Could you, you get for be committed to the canons of that city. Render your material in America, they say, Lady Justice in color blind, in status blind, in personality blind, in office blind. So, Mr. Koma, what me go one level do? Like I say, let we use. This opportunity as soon. No, no, you'll get caught up in you know argument here and there too. Because we all go hold on to respective opinions. But me will move away from your opinion. Yeah, when would they come with a counter that that would be the closing, that would be the closing because of course you talk about solution. And the reason the reason for being there. The reason why budge, the reason why budging, we get one caller, we want entertain only one caller. And the caller they're on now. So um yeah. Well, yeah, it's a combination of both. Uh, good evening to your panelists, then Mr. Kutubu and uh, your uh, other host, Superman, uh, Mina Roland Karimo. Uh, I've been, I don't follow this program today. Um, however, I guess a couple of uh, things I just want to interject in there. Uh, Prince, I want to make um, you finally there and the wider audience as Virginians and for noting this particular uh, court outcome. Nobody is the winner, but a positive sign for the judicial independence and the country because this is a situation where Virginians there is a new phenomenon. We will not be ever open to this. For let a country, a government accuse somebody of treason. It goes through the process. After that, then free us from that prison. It, it only applicable to supermate in your standard because this is what he's arguing out with. And the difference we I really want to let, you, let the audience they know today will be your two uh, guests there. Kutubu is a well respected um, TV funding, very objective. Superman, on the other hand, he is a humanist APC supporter. That we know for, for good. Even for me, in, in response, he did not say he is not actually trying to educate the people that on waiting at the base the objectivity of this thing, but it's just over the APC APC side. That is done and then we. But look, please, let people that know say, the reason why APC support, why APC is so much equivalent over this thing, including some people in our country, is because. 
for the next few days, after they come up with the, the training trial, they come out for the, the appeal facing with a loaded gun, right? Whether it's taken or state out, but it was within the precinct of state out, they find I'm not guilty. Now, see where nobody knows the imagine. To me, it's shocking, it's surprising, right? Because as far as we concern, if it was the previous day, now be, now, now be convicted of something. And now, come down to what you say about the prosecution case. Yes, even so, we we not to pass the law. To me, after calling all these things, I know that the presentation of the case on the prosecution side, it was weak. But then, the difference is, this government in power never planted evidence against the accused person. This memory made candles to apply content in case in 1987. The witness, the, the cases there, the evidence there, they were planted against me now because the case was already premeditated before he even go to trial. So if you have, if you just suppose these two cases, the treason trial of Paulo Conte in 2020 and the treason trial of Mina in 1987, even though Superman, the argument that they want, that they want to the government, but a treason trial is a treason trial. Evidence is not planted against Paulo Conte. He actually took the gun to the state house. A black Conte, the only weak case that na 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 before, because the government of the day, the best lawyer na Salu, they always emerge with the government of the day like they support. In this case, if a black country don't win a prison trial case, we forget the government of the radio. Because a black country on normal, normal cases, and not forever win this case that if there has been any interference from the, uh, from, from, from the executive. That's not the difference I want to let me know. So for Superman, for to make a black country like the DE and have it all, is a chance. Because a black country in legal seminary, something when they talk about, it only applicable when the government of the day, now, and come not in a black country side. In this case, a black country is not serving the government of the day. They don't win the same case. So we put that to the government of the day, but they don't interfere into the general something. So let's super make a day and know the difference between a black country in 1987, where it plants evidence against me that we are forced for help and for winning the case, even though there were some evidence that are not people that admit us. Because everything a black country was arguing about in court, it was accepted because that was a case that was never a treason against me now. So now that I mean, I mean, so let people have a chance to know this day. I, I mean, Paulo Conte was guilty of taking an arm to state house, where equal if it don't be found guilty of treason, having been that I mean, 1987, where uh, the likes of me now there, they not be found gone and in my house in the office and state house, they not been gone and in my house and outside there, they gone to the farm at Waterloo Street. Me now not believe that Waterloo Street. But yes, the black person the way now and convicted me, and like people rightly said, who does it uh, the next day? It was a black concept to be the next vice president. So you see the synergy between a black concept in cases where they argue, and the cases where a black concept prosecute and win, and the cases where a black concept defend, and I mean, and win, on the basis that the government of interfere. We are actually talking about the like, people who the pay. The credit should be given to the government because this particular decision of uh, court ruling away come on, it would have never been possible if we are in the only days of the radio. So we should give credit to the government. That's my contribution. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, so we're back again to Studio One after we, we are back again to Studio One after the contribution there by a guest. Okay, we got another call to come in. This is the problem when you allow one call for coming. Hold the line, please. Uh, hello. Hello, hello. Yeah, I'm sure you want to make a contribution. So hold the line for me one minute, please. Can you hear me? Yes, yes, I can hear you. Yes, can you hear me? Yes, um, just a, a brief input. You know, I'm so much uncomfortable with the fact that we have people who are bringing us to history, back to history. Yes, we are in a legal situation we are dealing with that takes a cognizance the use of precedence 
But for goodness sake, if we want to dig all these holes about precedence, what happened and what, are, what have we, are we ready to go through that? For example, what about the summary executions that took place? What about the situation with the, the cooler servants? Is that a precedent that we want to, to, to copy again? For goodness sake, let's just give praise to this man, he, 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 the, 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 the landed man, um, Abdul Bai Conte, for what he did in the 21st century. Let us leave this thing. Let us be an example to the to young people in this country. Begin to look at what happened in the past and blah, blah, blah. And besides, every case is very unique depending on the circumstance. You cannot force a past, a previous case to look like the present case. The reason why we need precedence is in a situation whereby they are just almost alike. And you may want to know how would I judge this case? Hence, they are, they are alike. That is where mostly precedents come in. But this case is, is, is not, it's not the same scenario or situation like the previous case. For goodness sake, let us stop deceiving people. And people saying to give government praise. Praise for what? In the first place, it was never a treason case. I mean, the, the, the Attorney General should have been in a better position to advise this nation that, you know, for what we have, there is no sufficient evidence. We cannot pursue this case. I mean, we'll prosecute this case or probably target as a treason case. Period. So, what kind, what kind of praise do you want us to give to the, to, to, to the president or to, to, to the country as well, I mean, to the government? The praise, if there is any praise, we should give that praise to the jurors, to the defense team, and we remain to give that praise to the jurors and defense team. And above all, Almighty God, this is my, my submission. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay, so let me just come back. Will you be out with me one minute? Be out with me one minute. So let's see what you got for a switch from channel to channel. Right. Okay, having a hard time here. Okay, um, Kutubu, if you hear me. Well, thank okay. you. So, Kutubu, if you hear me? Okay. If you go back. Yeah, so I want to you go ahead and wrap, wrap it up. Oh, Mr. Cool. Superman Kamara will get opportunity for respond. Oh, okay, thank because you. Because there was a lot said there about, um, um, from the first guest, I mean the first uh, caller, okay, and sir. Um, obviously we will give you a chance for let you respond. Having said that, yeah, wanna be with me, yeah. Oh dear. Is that good to me? Yeah, you are, you are, yeah, go, yeah, wrap up, okay. Well, yeah, you clearly. Yeah, so I want you wrap up. Okay, um, and I come back to you, but I want you, you've been on the statement before the caller make, but I want to use the opportunity for also wrap up. For and wrap then up. I go to Mohammed for let Mohammed respond because there was a lot said, you know, yeah, from the last, call, I mean, the caller before yes. the last. And then come back again to you, you know, everybody take one minute for wrap up. But um, the bottom line is, how do we go forward from here? And that's why I would like for end Good. of the program. Thank God. Well, I want to start off by thanking the colleague, Mr. Kamara. I want to thank her very much for taking time for Kaya. He put up a very, you know, brilliant argument. I mean, we are in positions, I mean, they're very okay, very erudite, very informative. And the other thing, the which happened between the two, we agree or disagree, but we were in a very gentlemanly way. Let, let God bless her for that. And Lord, continue to forget panelists, they're waiting in the car. We then go disagree, but then go still get that respect for one another. You know, that we will not care for fights, you know, just exchanges of opinion no more. So I really thank her for that and uh, really commend her. And I get high regards for her for, you know, standing the downs. Uh, me not they go back again to the case again, you know, now that the prophylactic measure that, that they mean it close now. The way at the close, we the ask ourselves now, Nasano, where do we go from here? We want, we the actually say whether we want to see an egalitarian and just society. We will all go be very proud of when they say, hey, Salu, guess what? Me not a Salunian. You see me country? 
na a great country. You see me country, it is offer this. You see me country, na a place where, you know, human rights, the citizens, the liberties, the ordinary. You see me country, every time we go for election, with the whole election, where I mean, the people that only put in power and the people that we want, not to people that only force themselves for Sidona, you don't know, no one that we want. When I go for work, they will give me the job because I qualified for them. Not to because I mean, me na sa sa me ban college just speaking. No, no, no. Me na kutubu or me me as a citizen get a right to them. So in other words, waiting we for Sidon the trouble now. We as we are, we write them. Not begin consolidate we are because the only way this war will be glad to forget the country. Let you know the even the very fairness what they talk about because most of the time when they do now the unjust way when they treat people there. Yes, we're glad for this case we happen. We're glad to at least allow yourself for once case don't go to court where the judge them. I don't care we can yet when they attack you. Wait till me they listen now the verdict where they give now the, how they arrive at the verdict, how they not arrive at the verdict as far as me concerned, it's like a moot point, a academic, and then they are called wait till happen. 12 ordinary people they say they are not guilty. Now this will therefore live by. Let we continue for pray God so we can get you or them where their minds could be open, where they remember. I make you they swear, where you swear and I for talk the truth. That for talk the truth. So they remember for God and Nabi and give justice, who side justice day. Let we that the only way this will judicial will be you work properly. When they stay away from they, them bad influence and they, you know, they want to give money for let no, no, not that member for God and Nabi. So again, I want to thank you very much also for hosting this program here. So and we listeners and we come, we say thank you. We all, you know, learn from the whole lot. And we hope say from time to time we get chance for And we are young one lady, make let them know say by God, for once on the while, salute talk for and we'll get for Canada. I'll go use the platform for talk me regular program. Them. So I don't want to tell you people then. Yeah, thanks for beating me to that, that because I was going, going to, I was so going I let to announce them know it. now. <laughs> say by God, for the car. So today again, I'll be hand over everybody to God. Thank you very much, sir, for the opportunity. I mean, uh, thank you so much. Um, thank you so much. Of course, um, I've been talking about uh, the program. We may really talk about about the talk forum being aired um, on the Then and Now platform uh, at the end of this program. But well, thank you so much. Um, Mr. Ka Mr. Kamara, um, I just give you the um, last word for respond. Um, probably you want to rebut or you want to talk back to um, the man who just um, spoke earlier, Mr. Rolling Stone. There was a lot said there. You sound very much partisan instead of being, you know, a, um, a national. You sound very much entrenched in in, 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 instead of being, you know, a sort of all encompassing and looking at the, the way forward, not in a tunnel like vision. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Brother Prince Mikuma, for your host me now. And I also want to say thank you very much to my fellow panelists, Mr. Kutubu. I get much respect for him and the question no more. Would they, for land for the agree? For disagree uh, peacefully and without civility, without respect for they among we say Alunians. Uh, that will make the debate and go a lot, lot, a lot, lot further. Um, in relation to the speaker, I mean, where the first caller, um, it's kind of unfortunate where we get this labeling ideology that we can't get elected today. It doesn't matter if somebody in an NGC, if an APC, if an SIPP or C4C, the person can able to get a genuine opinion, the person can be a progressive. Or a patriot, when they see issue, he can talk mainly on the issue. I believe, say, what I can talk today now, I don't mean not to, not to innuendo, not to just uh, um, like where the one that makes some fallacious or whatever statement them for. No, the case is here, uh, the case will happen, now we respond to it. got difficult for let we in turn, turn say, we give uh, credibility to the judiciary in the country. Now, let like, me like, give the listeners uh, and the viewers uh, one example. Now, as we talk so, a case then a case then then a court for conspiracy one one zero. Say today the people the way they 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 not get representative in the parliament. They make the election day. We all see them supporters them of the ruling party. Most people are letting and go they go vandalize. Now one baby pulling center. The videos are there openly and clearly. What they up? What the chief electoral commissioner do? It can it comes to the election. People and challenge them, they case and then a court. Set them no panel, they don't put panel, they don't put charges them for Sidon Palen case and then. So how the judiciary go say we say then a judiciary way they don't be influenced by nobody. If that case they when the one of the most uh, the basics 
of any democratic state for me, any constituency, many people and get the people when they represent in the parliament. That not ever happened. Up to now, when they talk so, constituency 110 has no representative in parliament. And okay. they do not call the case there. We we'll see it again, baby case them. These are just examples. <coughs> when nine, nine members of parliament, uh, when the constituency don't vote them go inside, whatever reason they pull in there, them cases in the appeal court, 30 days, they're not empowering judges for listening. Even the case them, according to the constitution, the time don't elapse. Okay, I guess it's you like can go, I guess, I, I guess, so, you, can you, go, I guess you can go, I guess you can go, I guess you can go on and on. Super, uh, Mr. The, uh, Mr. Mr. Kamara, the hang on. For this one green case. Mr. Kamara, hang on right all. there, hold your thoughts Mr. right there. Can you hear me? Hold your thoughts right there. Because I guess you can go on and on and on and on. Um, but in, um, 60 seconds how optimistic are you because you don't sound very much optimistic the case that you're laying but you can be optimistic at the same time with the hope say based on waiting don't happen now that hopefully we are turning a curve with a flip over a new page and the cases that you don't mention which are backlogs in terms of the justice uh, the justice system is concerned it will be looked into asap yes they have been you know yeah, out you know yeah, um, pending for quite a while, um, um, constituents have been deprived of representation, and that get massive ramification. We know this, but we are um, hoping that we are bending a curve, that we are turning a new page. In this regard, how hopeful are you going into the future regarding regarding a critical element of um, the three arms of government? In this case, the judiciary. Okay, thank you very much once again for wrapping up. 60 seconds, please. I want to agree with what Mr. Kutubu says, say, the Jews then, now they don't begin to think for God and Anabi. So they pray God, may they begin to think that way they say, hey, but it's not people in life, not people in which they call them now we earn. If we're not Jews then, that give me hope. We see Alonia and them, it give me hope for say, yes, by God in power, we pray for them. May God make people begin to think for God and Anabi that they ask, more like the justice department, the judiciary. It's very important for everyone to maintain our democracy in our country. So we we'll pray, and we a little bit hopeful. I don't want to say I'm not hopeful. I'm a little bit hopeful, although I also get my reservation because there are many things we're still outstanding, we're pending, where people need justice for that issue. Today. We they get for couple of issues now about land, not to go say what things you know. People don't get their life savings, they, they buy land. Look what is happening to them. You know, these are all serious issues. Look what is so... happening and I buy election at Tom Conniba. Where the kill one but where I think it's a lender and and this go that did not you know happen. So although yes, we will say we are hopeful, we will pray to God. You okay. know, because like me, I always say you say me not we believe God. Anytime they put in a God, they let God help we let God begin put so he asks the name people they ask so they way they name okay. the name okay. position okay. the name okay. that they ask. Okay. Thank you. God, they are happy. So Thank you. Thank you. When I hold the pastor, plenty plenty people in life rest our decision name. No, okay. no, no think about that critically instead of the past judgment um, well does the past anymore because of certain influences you know okay so, yes, oh, okay thank you so me. much okay. thank you so much and uh, mr kutubu one last word um 30 se i mean 60 seconds please yeah. um obviously yeah. you sound uh, you sound a bit more optimistic and hopeful that um we are kind of bending uh, a curve okay. flipping a new page in terms of the judiciary and justice system how justice will be meted out to the citizens but in the case where Superman just lay, the backlog of cases, how hopeful are you, sir, that we are turning this up and these cases are going to be looked into so mm -hmm. that this new acclaimed name of a clean judiciary, an independent judici uh, judiciary, will come to pass? Well, like we say, we hope say this that is stepping stone now for getting a good judiciary. And like talk about all the past cases, and now let them win them. But because in law, if you go to call justice delayed, like justice denied. We delay justice, you don't deny them. No, no, we God say with judiciary now go step out of their own role, their own role, not to forbid part of any political party, not for other equal. Then now then they sit down at the middle, they call that they the bastion of the constitutional liberty system. So if we cannot count on them for do that, you don't follow. I can live with bad government, I can live with bad party, but I'm not go live with a bad judiciary. You go at the end of the day, that the judiciary that they agree for go. So now not begin pray God. Say the we, we judiciary now we we'll get for the, the turn around, do the right thing, we case the room, and quickly we'll give proper judgment and fair judgment. 
the the I mean, rank or recrimination with this is so not only politician. I must tell you, now the judiciary them because they, they refuse for do their work and they need to do it properly. So na na in if we get the judiciary they do it work properly, I don't care what a politician do. And a, a, a good example na Malawi when the judiciary do their job, the citizens they're very happy. <laughs> they're very happy. So na that we go close up with. Do we are we need help from the judiciary and do the work? No, all be a very happy society. No, be a society we know will get hala hala. We know will get faith, faith and all that thing. Again, I want to thank my colleague very much and thank you, sir, for hosting with us. Um, thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. We've come to the end of another fantastic program on the Den and our platform. I just want to make this quick announcement, Una, that um, Mr. Kutubu and I we are we did in deep talks. You know, yeah, for like hosting in program on the Den and our platform, the Sierra Leone Talk Forum. If everything goes well, when I go begin see Kutubu Koma routinely on a chosen day and time, where it will appear within Salon Talk Forum. And to myself, no say, na critical broadcaster, and you didn't have home them via the internet, you know, yeah, service, the University of Open Network. So pretty soon we will see them. I also would like to make a disclaimer that the music played here in this particular segment of this conversation, we own no copyright um, to it. We just deploy them the cost for entertainment and educative reasons. We derive no profits at all, nothing at all from it other than education and entertainment. I want to say thank you so much to me. Two guests, them, they've been exceptionally fantastic, and I hope they will hit the points them home. Until we see again pretty soon, Mr. Mohamed Kamara again program the Come Up Insights Alone today. On our watch out for the flyer for this week, we will get for CM and hopefully we'll see Mr. Kutubu as well. But here is the thing, when we talk about the judiciary. Yes, we, it's good for us to be hopeful, but there are things then that we want to see. One uh, guest talked about the backlog of cases. You know, they've been outstanding. So if tomorrow morning we can wake up and see one of them cases and they have been called, we know that sure enough that we move, whether at a snail's pace, but it no matter at all, because yes, we are moving. Some people then say the president, if he want to kill Paolo, if he will kill him, well, if he didn't want to do that, he didn't do that at his own peril. And when you do the calculation on the basis of probability, he could not because we know the situation of the country. We also know, like um, one of the guests then say, not to one party rule with Depan, not to Trade, not to then, this now, now, and you get your moral guarantor them. So you can't take action where it will be detrimental, you know, here to your power where you want and your continuation, you know, for bring good services to the people there. Other than that, you become a pariah. So no, you cannot do that. And furthermore, economically, these are difficult times. COVID-19, means of earning are all shut down, basis for earning all shut down, airport shut down. So you depend on outside sources so they can come and dictate to you. So no, I don't agree with that notion. Secondly, I'm of the opinion that the president, it seems like now very powerful people already they walk the corridors of power, we actually try to push this case. And I think say one of the guests say that or intimate, intimated that. Now they try to actually push this case. And in the end, the case no get any merit at all. Hence it was dismissed. And it's a good thing that justice prevailed. Somebody said there's no winner. I believe there's a winner. And the winner is the Sierra Leonean people. And I want to commend the guests then once more. I want to thank you very much as I play the closing music for tonight. Thank you, Supermed. Thank you, Kutulu. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.